Is something wrong? Sounds like someone's in trouble. It's Jax. You heard some rumor about Tanakh the loitering around where they're not supposed to be. Took off south for Stone's Echo the next day to find him. Damn fool. Who is this Jax, exactly? My friend. Ain't it obvious? Bit younger than me, can still move without every bone creaking. <laughs> Knows his way around a bow, too. Good company to share a drink with. When there's sweet sap to drink anyway. But I told him, stick your hand in bramble and you're bound to catch a fist of thorns. Maybe I should find this guy. Stone's Echo, he said? That's right. Uh, if you don't mind me, these roots aren't gonna dig themselves. Stay safe. Uh, I'm uh, uh, not now. I must be closing in on the signal. We've taken our paradise for granted. The blind Land gods, the famine, they see are fallow. I was just thinking of you. We should have that. Please. What do you need? A squad of Tanakhas holed up in the cave to the south. I think they're in trouble. At least one of them is injured. I'm headed there to offer help, but with the Tanakh, such an offer might be perceived as an insult, even when help is needed. Will you come with me? I saw you speak before the chorus, so I know you can be persuasive. And if things get out of hand, I will be stronger with your spirit at my side. Isn't there someone in Plainsong who can go with you? Not with Tanakh rebels prowling our borders. No one wants to get involved. I'll do what I can. Good. I'm headed to their camp now. Please, follow. Why are you willing to help these Tanakhs if other Utara won't? I've dealt with the Tanakh before. I don't fear them. Do you really think they'll take an offer of help as an insult? Tanakh are by nature unpredictable. Anything is possible. Almost there.
The squad is camped inside. You there! This camp belongs to Eagle Squad. Retreat or die. At ease, Eagle. I'm not here for blood. Just to parlay. You know the parlay sign? Let us in so we can talk. So far, so good. Long way from the desert, aren't we? This one was blinded. Boy, nothing gets by you. Looks like your training mission didn't go according to plan. We're here to help, if you want it. How does an Utaro know we're on a training mission? He knew how to request a parlay, too. He's not Utaru. Or Tenax. He must be a veteran. A veteran? I didn't think there were any left. We don't need help from a washed-out farmer. Could have fooled me, judging by the look of things. Sister, it sounds like they just want to help us. Why not let them? What do we got to lose? You said you're on a training mission? A machine hunt. The final test before a young squad goes on active duty. Everything was going fine. We tracked a claw strider and hit it hard, but it fled into a herd of bristlebacks. One charge right at Kore. He dodged just in time and landed a strike as it passed. I hit an acid canister. The spray was like fire in my eyes. A terrible wound. I should have scouted ahead, spotted the herd. No, I should have spotted that canister. What does it mean to be a veteran? I was born to Nox, but offered to Utaro in exchange for tribute. Tribute? Back when there was plenty, the Utaru offered yearly gifts of food to the Tanakh to keep peace between them. Over time, this tribute grew into an exchange of people. The Tanakh needed able-bodied youth to fight their clan battles. And the Utaru needed veteran soldiers to train the defenders of Plainsong. I was just such a soldier. Was being the key word. You may yet need my spear, young warrior. What do you need? Supplies. Dried meat, ammunition, weapons, camping equipment. A lot of provisions for a trip back to the desert. Everything we need is at Riverwatch. A huge cache of war spoils up there, left over from the route. The route. When our forces drove the Karja back to Baron Light, they made sure the Kestrels felt the loss. Made it hurt. Marshal Canera shot a score of fleeing Karja from the top of Riverwatch, and her squad gathered the loot. It's all just sitting up there. Ours for the taking. Deadly machines are known to patrol that place, and the ruin itself is on the brink of collapse. You think machines and rotting ruins are enough to keep out Eagle Squad? No, but your injuries are. Let Jax and I grab these supplies for you. This is our mission. I'm not handing it over to some... Fine. Come with us. Fine. The three of you hold position. I'll be back. Be safe, sister. The ruin is this way. Once we get those supplies, everything will be fine. So you say. What's that supposed to mean? Your brother's condition is... That's not your problem, farmer. So you say. Stop saying that! Hey, calm down. We're trying to help, remember? So you say. We'll have to cut across the river. Ugh. Avoid the outlander camp down the road. Something wrong? I hate getting wet. Tough as a ravager, this one. I heard that.
We're here. The entrance should be right under that arch. Machines. I'm going in. No. Aloy's on point. Follow her lead.
it's the last of them. I had that. Give credit where credit is due, young one. Maybe I would have handled it better if I wasn't busy covering you, old man. Aren't I lucky? You know, if this is too much for your old bones, you can always head back. You should be more worried about that left arm than my old bones. I'll be fine. I'm Sakura of Eagle Squad. I feel no pain. <laughs> Ow! What is wrong with you? I guess the farmer hasn't lost all his fighting spirit. Supply should be up there. Taller than I thought. What's a deadly climb to Eagle Squad? What are you trying to say, old man? Enough. I'm a good climber. I'll grab the supplies. Come. Let's see if any of these machines have parts we can strip. Maybe I'll show you a thing or two. What could a farmer possibly know about salvage? Only decades of experience compared to your very brief existence. Okay. Gotta find a way into the ruins. 